Hello, my name is Dr. Diwan S. Raja. Today I will discuss about the anatomy of the femoral artery. The femoral artery is a large artery in the thigh and is the main artery to the lower limb. Location, the femoral artery begins at the inguinal ligament at the mid inguinal point. Mid inguinal point is the point between anterior superior iliac spine and pubic symphysis. It is a continuation of the external iliac artery. It travels down the thigh, passing through the femoral triangle. Femoral triangle is a triangular area bounded by the inguinal ligament, sartorius muscle, and the adductor longus muscle. Okay, passing to the femoral triangle, then through the adductor canal. Adductor canal is also called subsartorial canal, also called hunter's canal. To the adductor hiatus, adductor hiatus is opening in the adductor magnus. It is the it is the last opening of the adductor magnus. Other opening transmits the perforating branches. The last opening of the adductor magnus is called adductor hiatus. It is a osseoaponeurotic opening, and the femoral artery goes there and it continues down to the popliteal fossa as the popliteal artery. Branches of femoral artery. The femoral artery gives up several important branches. It has superficial branches, deep branches, also muscular branches, and genicular branches. Superficial epigastric artery, which is superficial, supplies the skin of the lower abdomen. Superficial circumflex iliac artery supplies the skin and superficial fascia of the groin. Superficial and deep external parental arteries supply the external genitalia. Deep artery of the thigh, this is very important, and this is the profunda femoris artery, also called arteria profunda femoris, the largest branch which supplies the deep structures of the thigh. Descending genicular artery contributes to the blood supply around the knee. Also, femoral artery has multiple muscular branches. Because it passes over the muscle, it supplies the muscles. Okay, if you look, go through the femoral artery, this is the, this is the femoral artery. Continuation of external iliac artery. External iliac artery is a branch of common iliac artery. Common iliac artery is a branch of the abdominal aorta. And we are seeing some relations. This is the femoral artery. And just lateral to it, we have the femoral nerve. Medial to it is the femoral vein. Okay. And this part, initial part, is in the femoral ring area. Underlying muscles, we have the pectineus muscle, iliosuous muscle, okay, underneath the, the femoral artery. Superficial to it is the skin, superficial fascia, deep fascia, okay, we got that. And this is the femoral artery. Here it is in the femoral triangle, this is the femoral triangle area, femoral triangle. Okay, this is femoral triangle. Okay, this is femoral triangle, and then it goes under the sartorius in the adductor canal or subsartorial canal or hunter's canal, and the femoral artery goes through the adductor hiatus, adductor hiatus going to the to the to the popliteal fossa. Okay going to the popliteal fossa from this onward it is going back going backward through the adductor hiatus in the popliteal fossa that is located behind the 
behind the knee okay we got that now if we study another figure we'll find out the aorta common iliac artery external iliac artery this internal iliac artery external iliac artery continued as that of the femoral artery femoral artery has multiple branches okay uh, one of the big branches the is the profunda femoris artery okay we got that we have the femoral artery going down through the femoral triangle then in the adductor canal or subsartial canal or high or the hunter's canal goes through the through the adductor hiatus and continued as the popliteal fossa here this is the this is the adductor hiatus going posteriorly as the popliteal artery this popliteal artery is a continuation of the femoral artery okay so femoral artery is a continuation of external iliac artery the popliteal artery is a continuation of the femoral artery and femoral artery is clinically important we can assess the femoral pulse here femoral artery is a site of catheterization and blood sampling also femoral artery may go through compression or may go through any region that may be risky sometimes and lot of complication may arise from any region or rupture of the femoral artery that may be life threatening hemorrhage may happen okay so anteriorly covered by the skin superficial fascia deep fascia and the anterior role of the femoral sheath this is the anterior relation the femoral artery posteriorly lies on the swast major muscle pectineus and the pectineus okay so pectineus and the adductor longus posterior wall of the femoral sheath intervenes between this structure and the femoral artery medially close to the femoral vein in the femoral triangle okay so femoral artery is lateral at the beginning in the femoral triangle femoral vein is medial the femoral vein gradually crosses the lateral side posterior to the femoral artery in the lower part laterally adjacent to the femoral nerve femoral nerve is lateral to the femoral artery iliacus muscle iliacus muscle is also lateral to the femoral artery and also we get the femoral branch of the genital femoral nerve that is coming from the lumbar fracture plexus l1 l2 okay it is a femoral branch that is also just lateral to the to the femoral artery and that nerve femoral branch of the genital femoral nerve supplies the skin of the femoral triangle area Clinical significance we discussed femoral artery is commonly used for medical procedures such as catheterization and arterial blood sampling due to its accessibility. It is, it is a critical artery for the supply of blood to the lower extremity. Blockage or injury can lead to significant issues such as ischemia, lack of blood flow to the lower limb here. Palpation of the femoral artery pulse can be used to assess circulation of the lower limb. Femoral artery aneurysm or injuries can be life threatening and requires prompt medical attention. And that's all about the anatomy of the femoral artery. If you have any question, please feel free to ask me. Please share the information with your friends. Please support my channel please subscribe me have a nice wonderful and blessed day bye now